I like the, the, just the beauty of our festival. Every year it builds more and more in terms of, of the clientele and the people who are discovering this. With. Because it was 11 o'clock in the morning or something like that and there were hundreds of people um, busting through the doors. Over the past six years, the Berkshire International Film Festival has become the festival of choice for filmmakers, film lovers, and people looking for a unique experience. It gives me an opportunity to, see, you know, it's, it's really like in the four days, you know, sometimes I feel like I've traveled all over the world. I've, you know, looked inside, you know, uh, 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 worlds and people's experiences, both, you know, intimate and incredibly, you know, wide open and sophisticated. And Hosted for four days in the beautiful Berkshire Hills of Western Massachusetts, the BIF, as it's affectionately known, is a film festival that connects audiences to compelling documentaries, award-winning international releases and premieres, incredible parties and events, and a taste of Hollywood just a short drive from New York and Boston. And, you know, that's, that's one thing that the BIF has been able to do, which is, you know, attract the filmmakers to come with their films. And so the audiences really get to have that extra experience of not just the film, but of being able to kind of interact with the people who made the film. And it's bringing people to the Berkshires. I think people who might not come just for the summer or for theater, you know, they're coming for film. The BIF has become the kickoff of the Berkshire cultural season, drawing over 3,000 people from New York, Boston, Pennsylvania, Vermont, D.C., and New Jersey. It's attracted uh, uh, an enormous response from, from uh, uh, you know, people all over. It's, it's, a, it's all very contained, and it's a very sort of perfect little atmosphere in which to have a festival. Throughout the past six years, the BIF has had the pleasure of welcoming the Academy's president, Sid Gannis, Mike Nichols, Leonard Nimoy, the beloved late Arthur Penn, Estelle Parsons, Kevin Bacon, Peter Riegert, Chris Noth, Lauren Ambrose, David Rashi, Douglas Trumbull, and Patricia Clarkson. You know, my own problem is, is that you can't see enough films. I mean, you know, we get sleep deprived uh, when we go to the festival, but it's, it's an incredible opportunity to see films that you might not have a chance to see otherwise. Um, uh, you know, if you're a documentary lover like I am, um, you know, I just gorge on documentaries during the festival. The BIF has also entertained audiences with dozens of filmmaker talks and over 300 pre-released films, many of which have gone on to be nominated for Academy Awards, including Food Inc., Burma VJ, War Dance, In the Loop, The Garden, Frozen River, and the 2008 Academy Award winning documentary Man on Wire. And the films that, that have been put together, I mean, I think there's very few films that, that have been part of the Berkshire Film Festival that, that you have not seen uh, very rapidly uh, advertised in the New York Times or that have, have gone on to greater success. The BIF is growing, screening over 75 films on eight screens in multiple locations across the region. The BIF hosts a prestigious juried prize award for documentary and narrative feature films and has teamed up with Berkshire Begg to present an award for best short film. The BIF is a year-round presence, screening films, hosting filmmakers and presenting special events each month through the Real Friends Film Society. You're, you're in for a nice treat, you know, so enjoy, enjoy the films, enjoy the Berkshires, uh, and, and support BIF because uh, it, it's, it's really worth, uh, it's worth every effort and you, you can lose yourself in a nice, nice fashion here. The BIF is about entertaining, engaging, educating, and bringing our community to another level. It's a fun, moving, captivating, and inspiring experience during the four-day festival and throughout the year. Set in the beautiful Berkshire Hills with all that the region has to offer in art, music, theater, and dance. I encourage everybody in the community to become a part of the Real Friends because, you know, that's, that's how, how the festival will be able to sustain itself and, and grow. We need you. <laughs>